You get here and you lug in a whole load of gear and then you spend several hours setting it up, making it sound good. And then the producer engineer usually makes you play rock beat one for about an hour while they get things sounding right. And then for us, we tend to crack into recording some tunes where the whole band sets up and we play live. And so you lay down the foundation of the track where the, the drums go first and then, and then we like to do the guitars and then the bass and then the lead guitars and then the vocals in that, that sort of order. Oh look, it doesn't matter how good I feel going into it, Tom will make sure I feel like shit by the end of the day. But he likes to drive the band, and I think particularly the drummer, because he's a drummer, just drive them to a point of getting the, the best result. Doing seven songs over the next couple of weeks, so this is all completely fresh material that hasn't been performed live yet. So we've got four that we've tracked already, a couple have been released, um, and then two others that haven't been released yet, and we did those all over in, in Melbourne at Tom's studio um, with Tom and John. And so, yeah, to, to fill out the album, we yeah we wanted to do 10 or 11 songs, and, and so seven was the number. And there's a really good variation of like, there's a couple of like more softer, ambient kind of stuff. Um, there's a couple of songs that are a bit bluesier. And then there's a couple of really good sort of like more riffy, heavy sounding stuff. <laughs> 